patients who have uh, thyroid cancer, it's the most common endocrine malignancy. 60,000 patients in the U.S. will be diagnosed and about 1,800 will actually die of the disease. 80% of those patients have differentiated thyroid cancer, which is the most common type. 90% of the patients actually will do well with surgery and radioactive iodine therapy, which is great news. However, 10% of the patients will not, and they'll actually succumb to their disease. And once the radioactive iodine stops working, what we call RAI refractory or radioactive iodine refractory patients, those patients have an overall survival of only two and a half to three and a half years. So serafinib was seen to have activity in phase two trials in prior to this study. And so we designed a phase three, pivotal phase three, double blind randomized trial to ask the question, what is the efficacy and what is the safety of this drug for this patient population? So 417 patients were enrolled and they were randomized worldwide. Patient's um, primary endpoint was progression-free survival. And when we look at the results, it turns out that it was a positive trial. And indeed, uh, serafinib extended progression-free survival from 5.8 to 10.8 months.